Hey guys and welcome to the episode of Trailer Reactions. Today we got ourselves a trailer called Back in Time, official trailer number one, Back to the Future documentary. Um, this came out a while ago, but we're going to jump into this bad boy. Hopefully it's something entertaining, and um, if not, then eh, whatever. But uh, we're going to jump into this bad boy. Um, yeah, so, of course, come on, play. Of course, I'm excited about it. We're sitting oh, in the theater we waiting for the Royals to come in, and I realized that the seat next to me is empty, and then it dawns on me that Princess Diana is going to be sitting next to me. The movie starts, and it occurs to me that I'm like, like a fake yawn and an arm stretch away from being on a date <laughs> with the Princess of Wales. <laughs> visiting my parents over the summer of 1980, came across my father's high school yearbook. My father had gone to the same high school that I went to. And I'm thinking, if I'd gone to high school with my dad, would I have been friends with him? It really is, for me, and arguably the greatest time travel movie ever put on film. If we would have done something different at one moment, would it have changed our whole lives for the better? I think it's the best thing that I've ever written. I mean, along with Bob, of course. But Zemeckis and Gale really found lightning in a bottle. You probably have one of those in your in a lifetime. <laughs> lightning in a bottle tends to stick around for a long time. Universal put us in touch with a product placement company. They said to me, if you change the DeLorean to a Ford Mustang, you'll get $75,000. And I looked this guy straight in the eye and I said, Doc Brown doesn't drive a Mustang. <laughs> Back to the Future knows no boundaries within a certain country. It's worldwide. It reaches everyone. It has such resonance with what we're trying to do with Secret Cinema. You can be anyone you want to be and you can do anything you want to do. They want to be Marty McFly. They want to travel back to the future. They want to fall in love with their mother. I'm joking. I actually kind of connected a little bit with George McFly. He's a guy that was an outcast. He had big dreams. He had big goals of being this person that no one else thought that he could be. Here's this iconic piece of so many people's childhoods just sitting there falling apart and rotting. Something's got to be done about this. Let's restore it. I'll do it. It's great to have a bunch of lunatics on your side. We maxed out mm -hmm. that card on a DeLorean. What are they doing with that car? They drive around the country working for Michael J. Fox's charity. They're crazy, but they're crazy cool. good. It was the right thing to do. Life has taken us places we really never knew it would take us. And that's what Back to the Future is about. The movie defines the taste of butter popcorn. And of course, <laughs> they picked the right song. <laughs> definitely a classic movie uh, i love the movies and yeah i i definitely want to check that out or you know it's better than you know any other uh what do you call it um i guess documentaries they've done i you have all these actors are still around they're still you know live and kicking so we get to get to hear from them themselves their experiences stuff like that and what it's done for them and and to see the, and just, they get to see you know what it's done for everybody else and what everybody else has enjoyed of these movies so I'm definitely going to check it out. Let me know what you guys thought of this trailer. Let me know guys, you check it out. Let me know what you guys thought of Back to the Future movie as a whole. The whole series. Which one was, was your favorite? Which one was your least favorite? And are you going to get it on Blu-ray? I know it's, it's either coming out on Blu-ray or it's already out on Blu-ray then 30th or whatever, some anniversary edition. Um, but let me know what you guys think. All right, guys, remember, hit that like button. Hit that dislike button. Follow me on Facebook. Follow me on Twitter. Subscribe if you have not subscribed. I got plenty more coming up. All right, guys, see you. Bye.